One of those evil parasites is about to save your royal ass. My ass is safely lodged in the Aegean stables, and mortals will never be anything but a mistake. Care to make a wager? If I'm right, my sin of stealing fire and ensuring their survival becomes a blessing. You find your punishment unjust? It's a little... extreme. Do we have a deal? If you win, I'll end your punishment and set you free. But if I win, you help me stop Typhon, whatever it takes. Very well. Let the tale of Phoenix be my redemption! Oh no, not one of your stories. How long is this going to... I'm back. My tale begins at sea. A ship of soldiers returning from a faraway battle. Their victory ambushed by an unexpected storm. The sea tossed and turned. Waves churned to a froth. The line between sky and sea all but vanished. The mountainous peaks of the waves descended into valleys nearly as deep as Tartarus. You're really painting a picture here. It's an art. Point is, the ship didn't stand a chance. At dawn, the sun rose on the few remaining survivors. The lowest ranked among them, a shield bearer who dreamt of battle but had seen nary a Wait, skirmish. Wait, don't tell me. Ah, okay. I had to make my character. Hair like. Uh... Body like uh, this. Tan like me at the beach. The color of stirred yoga. Skin dark like olives. The good kind, not the green ones. That's crazy you can make a character green. I wonder if I, I should make like an orc. And I'm just gonna make an orc, uh, an orc character. Face like a face you know, I can see in my mind. Face. A sharp bird. Eyes the color of fresh mushrooms. I wonder if it's even possible. Like an orc shaman has a beard. The face is so like clean and pretty, though you know. It's, it's gonna depend on the hairstyle. Hair is like way too clean. A waterfall on the cliffs of Santorini. Man, if I can put stock in a hairstyle. This hairstyle has like blown up in popularity in every facet. It's kind of nuts. It's literally everywhere. Cannot. You cannot avoid that hairstyle. I'm going to use it. Give myself gray hair. I'm going to try to make myself an eyebrows. orc. I need big bushy eyebrows. There you go. Big mean eyebrows. Rawr, big bushy eyebrows. Yeah, man. It just doesn't... I can't, like, really sell the look. Because the face is so happy. Just a happy face. Close as I can get. We got a better beard. Like Apollo's chest hair. You got a full beard? 
New Deathstroke has it in Snyder Cut. Dude, it's everywhere, man. The hairstyle is just, it's just everywhere. There you go. I'm gonna make my character an orc. The storm, wake up. I have to wake up. The storm, wake up. I have to wake up. The storm, wake up. I have to wake up. The storm, wake up. I have to Wait a wake minute. Up. How come the voices sound so far away? The storm, wake up. I have to wake up. Make sure my sound settings are set up correctly. I don't know why the voices sound like that voice test sounds real weird. Unless it's meant to be coming from the controller speakers. You know? The storm. The storm. Wake up. I have to wake up. The storm. Wake up. I literally can't I hear that voice. Whatever that thing is testing, can't hear it. But it's okay, I'm an orc. I'm an orc. There, I see him clear as day. <clears throat> the lowest ranked among them, a shield bearer. Who dreamt of battle, but had seen nary a skirmish. A teller of tales, not a doer of deeds. Phoenix. What a name, Phoenix. Sounds like the sound a dumb bird makes when it lights itself on fire. Which would be ridiculous. Although, I should write that down. Washed up on an unknown shore. Phoenix awoke. <coughs> I don't know. Do you do you hear like when he coughed? Did anything? It's like I'm getting no voice out of the center channel. Captain. Can anyone hear me? See, like right there, I don't hear his voice at all. What the hell's going on? Looks like the only way off this beach is up that cliff. Yeah, my character is definitely not like talking normally, if that makes sense. Wait, so you can hear it? You can hear his voice normal? In my game, I cannot hear his voice. Like, I, it just sounds like complete, completely hollow. Social Hunter is subbed on YouTube, thank you. Weird, so it must be my audio setup then. I can hear the music, I just can't hear his voice. Why would it not work for... I'm trying to think about what about my audio setup would cause that to happen. Like why I wouldn't have a, a center channel. Doesn't really make sense? Uh... Oh, there we go. Let me choose two channel. Maybe I was trying to emulate. Weird. Now, now let me see if I can hear his voice. It's so there is audio on the PS5 has been a little strange. Okay, now I can hear him. That little like, huh, huh, I can actually hear that now. Yeah, that's what it was. So mind you, my audio setup is a little extreme because I have a mix amp. I have my consoles have HDMI that go into a switch, an HDMI matrix that has four inputs and two outputs. And then um, 
that matrix has an optical cable that goes one optical cable goes into my soundbar other optical cable goes into my mix amp then the console gets routed to the mix amp via hdmi and it gets down mixed via optical to the mix amp to my headphones so it's kind of a crazy daisy chain setup i have set up and sometimes because the playstation has so much audio options it's not a bad thing it just doesn't know what to pick by default um and that's how i end up like that where i just couldn't hear the guy's voice but i got it fixed i gotta i gotta just choose a amplifier which makes sense as i am connected to an amp you know, i am on the mix amp so i i get that I heard from a couple of, also I'm playing Immortals Phoenix for review. Um, Ubisoft sent this to me today and uh, they said I'm free to play it. I can play it right now. Uh, they did also mention, and actually I heard from some people who I trust that this is definitely the surprise of the holiday season in terms of like just a much better title than they were expecting. Um So I'm like, all right, I'm interested. I've had multiple people say it's clearly Phoenix better than Watch Dogs, clearly better than Assassin's Creed. Through a trick of the light, he could almost see them waving and calling to him. Phoenix, again. You may not be your brother Ligiron, but I will make something of you yet. Hold my shield. Try not to drop it this time. I didn't see you there. Don't let them get to you. They're just jealous. It's not often someone has a brother like yours. Lokogos! Lokogos, can you hear me? You've gone cold. What magic is this? Ligiron! Where are you, brother? Hey, yeah, I'm I can hear my character now, fine. Great. Phoenix was vulnerable. I have to be calm. I have to follow my training. Okay. Use the compass to locate objectives and orient yourself in the war. I mean, I played 150 hours of Odyssey, so... No! I'm curious to see how this game differs. Oh. Get on, brother. I'm surprised the character actually speaks, honestly. You've always been my hero, my North Star. I will bring you back. I swear it. Okay, yeah, the faces are a lot better in game because they animate so well. I thought I was gonna have that goofy ass smile on my face the whole time. Phoenix had never been allowed to hold the hallowed sword. A gift from Achilles for bravery in battle. It balanced perfectly in his palm. As if forged for it. Achilles sword? Brother must have been good in battle. Is something wrong with your voice? I never got a sword. Just saying. Phoenix looked up. He was not alone. By the gods! Stay back! He readied his sword for his first real fight. <laughs> Felt his training come into focus. We should be able to survey the land from up there.
Yeah, uh, this is actually uh, the combat feels very different than the Assassin's Creed games, especially Valhalla. Very like uh, felt it, and you have like a good dodge. It, it's actually not a the worst comparison. Jablo is the Dark Siders comparison, just off like a really brief initial feel. But like I said, I had so a couple people who I trust. They, you know, they enjoyed Watch Dogs enough. They really liked Valhalla, which so far I'm really liking Valhalla. But they said that this game came out of nowhere and was a huge surprise for all gaming, not just Ubisoft games. And brother, boring. Can we skip this part? No, this is important for the sense of atmosphere. So it's like. I was like, okay, I got more excited to play it when I saw that, and like, I actually really like these narrators so far. <laughs> Pretty funny. Hermes, my old friend. It's an honor to finally meet you in person. Just don't tell anyone I'm speaking to you. I got in enough trouble for memorizing stories instead of tilling the soil back at home. And then the other soldiers? Well, they really don't appreciate a good story. Phoenix's destiny was becoming clear. So far, all you have shown me is a mortal soldier who has fought one real battle, and Typhon grows stronger by the hour. Don't toy with me, Prometheus. I swear to you that soldier shall be our salvation. For if he fails and Typhon defeats us, Zeus, king of gods, the world will fall to chaos. A temple of Apollo? If it has an oracle or a seer, they could help me undo this curse. A griffin? But they aren't real. Let me go! Help! Hey! I'll save you! I'm coming! I need to find a way to reach that rift. Mm. Well, I got bad news for you, Jablo. That's all the that's the only kind of game that exists anymore. Fire. Vault of Tartarus. Thing feels crazy with the uh, haptics. Yeah, so this is the the creators of Assassin's Creed Odyssey directly making a game inspired by Breath of the Wild. They've said as much, even the review guide. Which is pretty interesting straight up mentions like yes, this is us Really trying to make something that's uh, An inspiration directly from that game kind of like Genshin Impact, you know Although That's more of its own genre in a lot of ways and right, still finding stuff I just got into a fight. I'm revealing. A, I feel like I'm revealing a lot of the map. Ambrosia detective. Wow. Oh, snap.
Jump in the pond below. Okay, so I can like see everything in the map. Oh, how big is this game? Oh, man. Yikes. Well, I gotta, I gotta say, Jablo, to be fair, you only have an Xbox. I think PS5, after using them both, definitely has a much stronger next-gen launch. But I mean, that's, you know, kind of obvious. Like, Miles Morales and uh, Demon's Souls are pretty incredible, gotta say. And neither of them, uh, open world games. Oh, wow. Sword combo. Well, I mean, Miles Morales is an open world game, but you can beat it in eight hours. Is it... Jump. Can I make my jump better? Okay, no, this is stuff I have by default. Okay. And then I want R1. Oh, baby, Perry. You know, you guys, you know me. I love a good parry. Oh, air combos? Ooh. I like me some air. Oh, this is... So I have no skill points yet. That's literally all stuff I start with. All right. Kind of my basic look here. Quick save. That's that's so weird, Jablo. How to get down? The pond. I think it's such a strange thing for someone who likes video games, especially ones that aren't open world, to shun PlayStation. It's such a weird decision. Yeah. What is this? It smells like honey, and the first day of spring, and my first kiss. All rolled into one. Phoenix got into the Ambrosia too? Prometheus! You worried, Zeus, about losing this bet? Please, he can't use it anyway. Uh, yet. I gotta jump into that pond below. Okay. I, got, I guess I, I, I'm in that position where it's like, I, you know... I feel nothing watching Demon Souls. I'd have to play it. I would. Mm, I'd be surprised if Ragnarok's on a PS on PS4. I mean, by, by, by that argument, though, you could have played Call of Duty Zombies and Gears Tactics on an Xbox One. Of the heavy responsibility. You gave him your blade? Oh, Achilles. I, I meant to ask, why exactly would you expect to receive a sword from Achilles? Oh, uh, as an offering, just a routine offering from someone who gazed into your eyes and told you you were special. That's all. I left a rose on his breastplate. Got something in my eye. Keep going. What's up, Blaze? Several reasons I don't. News. See I didn't want to play. Whoa, well, I, I can't plan for you when you don't get on till like five in the afternoon. He consorts with all mortals and immortals. Little he profits, but through the dark night, he continually tricks. That's nice. Who wrote that? My favorite poet, who just happens to not have been born yet. What the hell is this bad boy? Uh. Hmm. All right, I said I have to find small ones, then I can find the big one. I can do that.
There's water here. Oh, I can go underwater? I was not uh, expecting to be able to go underwater. Okay. I, I think Xbox games are going to be $70 as well. I think uh, I actually wonder what happens to Game Pass if the Xbox games go to seventy dollars. Bill Spencer said they're not going to increase the price of it, but they also said they weren't going to make games seventy dollars, and now they're backstepping on that pretty quick. Gotta go down this way. All right, I'll just keep exploring. Seems like it's just letting me kind of go wherever I want. I am playing on hard, by the way, because uh, seems like that's just the right way to play a Breath of the Wild experience. Oh my God, bro. Oh my God, mistakes are made. Oh, shit. I don't know if I'm gonna win this fight. I'm not gonna lie. Woo! Uh, let me climb, sir. Okay. Oh, you can't parry that. Bear is fucking huge. Let's go, baby. I cannot be stopped. I'm, I'm the RPG god. I'm dead. Hello, I need help. Game Pass is legit. Game Pass is that S word. All right, uh, Blaze, where are you? Aren't you working? T did you work today? No, you had today off, right? Or did you have? Did you have yesterday off. I don't know what days you be having off. Wow, then. So I don't get my health back at all. Oh my god, I. I'll have to swim to the other shore. I don't know why I'm playing on hard. Boy, Namtox is a dum dum. So Ambrosia is just straight up like the heart containers in Breath of the Wild. Like I just get more health. All right, what's this bad boy here? Hello? Can you hear me in there? I'm coming. I found your axe. Suga Sorrow, this is the Phoenix PS5 version. The axe, feeling it call to him. Looks like the axe of Atalanta. That must be a copy. Although... But before Phoenix could claim it, the axe was pulled into the pit by a terrible force. Who knocks upon my door? No one. You think that old trick will work on me? Come into my parlor, send the Cyclops to the sailor. Uh, I don't want to go in the mysterious vault. Yeah, this is the PS5 version and I'm running in performance mode, which is a locked 60 frames per second. 
This is the very well, kind of first hour of the game. Of Phoenix. Perfectly passable storytelling. I won't lie, Wait, there were moments that dragged, but you really got me with that ending. Now, let's settle up. Time for you to help me against Typhon. It's not over yet. Not by a long shot. That was pretty good. <laughs> Everyone, Zeus made every part of the game. I like breaking the fourth wall like that, especially in a game like an open world RPG where there's a billion of them. Anything to kind of separate it from the standard thing is uh, pretty entertaining. What is this place? Entering passage in the abyss. Blaze, you better be watching me at 1080p, 4K, 360, vision, it's VR Tartarus. at work. Just exactly where had Phoenix landed? Tartarus, the nasty abyss where I imprisoned Typhon. He must have opened rifts into the vaults of the underworld when he escaped. You know it, I know it. Say it. Phoenix wasn't, uh, sure. I hate you. But aren't you intrigued? No. Keep going. I do like that, uh, Breath of the Wild made, made up the, uh, shrines. And Genshin Impact and now this game have their own version of shrines that literally look like they take place in the exact same realm. This weird, like, floaty platforms in the middle of, like, the galaxy and shit. I think it's so... It's interesting to see how influential that game is. You are either brave, little one, or very foolish. Let's see if you can meet my challenge. Or if you will fall like all the others. Who are you? Hello? How is everyone's holiday, by the way? Oh, my man elbow dropped the chest. I love it. Left to use a health potion. Okay. Oh, I see what I gotta do. Got it. Got it. Not a problem, Chief. Not my first video game. You know what I mean? I can't see you yet, but I will. What's this? Wings? Phoenix ran his hands over them, noticing that several pieces were missing. As if someone had ripped them apart. They seem to be man-made. I wonder how they work. If they even work. Guessing I can be a very glidey boy now? Oh, Ooh! They actually work! Sort of. That is sick. Dude, I love that. It looks like how oh, it comes out of his back. <laughs> That is real nice. Like that. He Blaze would destroy this game. Like Demon Souls, like that's a game for men. Like I don't think he can handle it. This game though, perfect, perfect for him. The axe of Atalanta. Deadliest of hunters. Swiftest of heroes. Fallen at the hands of Typhon. Didn't I change her into a lion? You turned a lot of people into a lot of things. I need to stop drinking. I'm an orc. And now you fall, little one. Whoa. Still standing. 
mind. I sense something more in you. Dude, I like the combat system. It's so like uh it's not similar to the Assassin's Creed games at all. Like I really thought this would be like Odyssey with the reskin. But this combat system is like super good. It's like very dark sider. Very fascinating. A bolt of my lightning! Scattered, hidden by Typhon. It's over! Phoenix is Helios Ash! No one can handle those bolts but me! Oh, really? Ah. Forgot I can double jump already. It took me about 30 seconds. My uh, Alzheimer's. Zeus's lightning bolt? No way! Power surged through Phoenix. It was too much for him to bear. Uh, what's happening to me? Bye-bye, mortal. And then, just like that, it stopped. No! The wings grounded the lightning. They were designed to withstand storms. That shouldn't be possible. And yet, this is just the beginning. Whoa, that looks awesome. Having plunged into the abyss of Tartarus and living to tell the tale, Phoenix emerged victorious. For now? Stranger I was chasing. Where did he go? With the wings, he would be able to flit across the ancient bridge and find out. I wouldn't just strap on discarded junk. Who knows where those have been? Many a night, Phoenix had told tales of a genius. An inventor named Daedalus and his extraordinary wings. Perhaps someone copied their design, Phoenix mused. So junk? Ooh. Maybe it's cursed. I if I can climb this wall. No, I cannot. Not. Look at the map. Wow, there are multiple wings I'm gonna be grabbing? Okay, head back to that landmass then. Oh, you can fast travel with the individual challenges? Hmm. 
Yeah, I like the feel of this like a nice light action adventure, you know, it just feels I wasn't expecting it to feel like this at all if that makes sense Okay, I'm right here. I'm right here. Bad boy. Yeah. Like golden amber to upgrade the potency of your potion. Uh, pot? I'll take it with me just in case. This feels like the type of game that used to get made on the uh, not 360 or PS3 a lot, but on the PS2 and the original Xbox a lot. This this may have the trappings of a, a blockbuster all-star. You know what I mean? And, and you guys know what I mean by that. You know, it's that type of game. You know. You want you, you went to Blockbuster like three times that month. You already beat the game you knew you wanted to play. You know what I mean? Like you beat that game. And you definitely know that you don't want to rent the shitty sports game that comes out every year because you know exactly what that is. But you're at the video store, you wanna rent something, you know? Like you gotta you gotta play something new that weekend. So you just go grabbing grams, looking at the box art, you know. This one looks like it has some promise. Oh, no. Immortals, Phoenix, I guess. I'll try it out. And that's how you get an all-star. When I first played um, Darksiders, it was that exact same situation. I honestly didn't know anything about Darksiders. I didn't see a lot of previews talk about Darksiders. No one mentioned it, you know, it wasn't like hyped up and it came out in January and you got to remember in January in back in the day, not so much anymore, but about eight or nine years ago, January was like for games was like movies. It was like you know, games came out in January that nobody kind of believed in, you know, like just just I guess we need to release this game. It's not gonna be any good. Just dump it in January. Kind of forget about it Move on uh, But yeah, I, I remember it renting Darksiders Because it was the only new game that came out in January, you know Christmas just passed I already got all the Christmas games Um see If I can mark that oh, I can mark multiple things And this, I just remember renting Darksiders because it's literally the only new game. And the cover looked cool. And uh, I remember the back of the box didn't even have like review qu quotes, you know? Like there wasn't even fake review quotes in the back of the box. It was just like the game description. And you know, I was like, fuck it, I'll try this game. I don't know nothing about it. And man, I remember booting that game up, seeing the intro when he comes in and it just being fucking mind blown at how absolutely incredible that game was could not believe it completely fell in love with that thing i cannot get up there with my character's measly travel abilities no way this feels like how that felt like back in the day like it's just a 
like a straight up I'm not saying it's as good as dark side I'm not making that kind of proclamation but I'm just saying like in terms of like you know, very little attention being paid to it honestly the most attention this game got was the name being changed oh, what the fuck oh oh we're alive Did he like teleport up top after I killed him? But it feels like that, you know, like this is the most attention this game got was the name change. And then people were just assumed it would play like Odyssey. Not playing like Odyssey. At all. This is like a straight up. Oh, what? Look at him flying. He went flying. Bye. Oh, wait. What? I can chop these trees? Oh, that's why some of the trees are glowing. Oh, okay. If glowy tree discover, chop it uh, for the, for one another. Yeah, the, the combat is is super fun. See if I can just do a running jump and then <laughs> too hard my butt. Where am I? Yeah, my problem is I don't think I can climb any of that yet. Okay. Let's go to where I'm supposed to go. I definitely need the like ability to uh, like fast travel or uh, not fast travel to glide, you know? Once I glide, I'll be able to make it over there. Yeah, this definitely would be this would definitely be the makings of a Hollywood video all-star like I, after playing even this first 50 minutes I would immediately have to tell like one of my friends about it. I'm like dude got this game immortals It's thriving man. It's like it's fucking action adventure thing like it's fucking cool It's really polished. I would overhype this game immediately After only about an hour playing Bye, idiot. I love watching them fly away when you beat them in combat. Honestly, I'm very surprised the character speaks. I like his voice a lot, too. Whoa! I'm coming to help. Hold on. I don't know what you want me to do. I, can, I can't even. Only the gear on was here. Fight flying He's guys. The famous hero, not me. What am I going to do? Put the fiends of Tartaros to sleep with storytelling? 
And his voice is, is really good, though. It's not just the other characters. Unlike the mortal flesh, which had been frozen into marble, the pomegranate sprung forth defiantly, bursting with life. A lot of poetry for something that just got a stick in their mouth. Isn't that what the best poetry is about? <laughs> I wonder if I can parry their uh, charge. Oh, well, you know, it would help if I... You definitely parry their charge. What say you? Oh, Katy Perry hype. For those uh, new to the channel, Just know that I'm a parry god in every video game I play. I gotta say, obviously I'm playing on next gen console, clearly. But uh, this frame rate is not dropping at all and let me tell you how smooth it feels it's feeling quite nice Breath of the Wild thing too, where you like just dodge at the right time. that I only have a certain amount of time to reach over there got it you hear the music and stuff that's awesome there's so much good flavor here of Charon. A strange coin bearing Charon's mark. Typhon stole those too? Charon was saving up for a bridge. Yeah, it seems like stamina is strictly a uh, traversal mechanism. Like there's no kind of system like that with the combat. Combat feels very fast and responsive like you can cancel out of the animations like real fast like you know what I mean like before the first swing that's the basic jab swing r1 I can cancel out of that with the, the dodge like very responsive I like it I like the combat uh that's the shit I do like I don't know what those poor chickens did to deserve that but uh they paid the price 
should have uh, put some respect on my name. The environment is interesting. Everything here is like very destroyed. Sneak up on it. Uh oh, Gorgonzola. And this tutorial island is just like these braces, upgrades everywhere. I've seen them in drawings. They can't be. Ah, but they were. Heracles, mightiest of mortals, slayer of beasts, defied Hera, and accomplished the impossible wearing those bracers. And now they belong to Phoenix. Through damn luck. After boldly besting the Gorgon that ambushed Heracles. What are you doing there? That thing with your voice? The Heracles? Yeah, that! That is how it's supposed to be pronounced. Seems like a lot of work, but it's your funeral. Except I can't die. Don't remind me. By the gods! I feel like I could lift a mountain! Ah, if only those bracers could move this one. Hades alive! You two! Get a room! Dude, they really brought in the magnetic lift from uh, Breath of the Wild? <laughs> like, wow! Not even trying to be subtle about it. Interesting. New gear. Oh, there's actual gear with... Interesting. You can toggle it on or off. There's a lion armor set. I didn't think you could actually get gear and change how you look. I'm just gonna keep that helmet right now because it looks pretty ridiculous. I do like you hit up in the D-pad for a quick save. Nice. One of my biggest pet peeves is when a game says it has quick save, but it takes forever to do it. Okay. If I get one more, I think I increase my health bar. See if I can kill that Gorgon. Oh, 
Oh, you totally can! Oh yeah, the Bastion influence is really, uh, really, really prudent. It's funny how Bastion kind of like really kicked off like uh, having narration in games, you know? That was, just really wasn't a thing until Bastion having a narrator. card just tells you godly power you don't have yet is required that's actually very respectful of my time the tale of Midas is a good lesson for mortals careful what you wish for he could neither eat nor drink, because all he touched turned to gold. Lucky gods don't have to eat. I would be rich! And a good lesson for you would be, not everything is about Zeus. Alright, I can't make him hold that. I'm trying to see if I can get him to hold it. on this thing. Totally. Actually, I have some adventuring elements. switches of the four I need even if I open the door though I don't think I could even kill the guy that's inside because I'm still missing a power you know like, I just could stop before I can complete door opening ritual Diablo, I can't even comprehend the sentence like I can't wait to play Hades in a few years. 
<laughs> next to a game that as of right now doesn't even have a release date hasn't even been acknowledged outside of them announcing it to begin with Hades is incredible and it's probably the game of the year Unavailable one in conflict. Who am I in conflict with? I don't see no one around me trying to fight. I maybe that whole area is a conflict zone. Head for the actual objective. No, no, no. Oh, damn. That's ridiculous. But I wonder if I can throw it. Nope. It just broke apart. There's my only rock. Never mind my idea. It was stupid. They would actually kill that guy in a single blow. Bad. Crap, I can pick up the tree logs? Wasn't the turtle's head there was an item? Back to the uh, flea man to the turtle shaped island. Something down here then, right? into that vault. I'll save you. I promise. Not another vault. Come on. Wait a minute. This whole time.
This fucking game. I'm over here concocting all sorts of harebrained schemes. Oh, at least I figured it out. Talk about overthinking a solution, though. Give me that power. The wings. Hmm. Welcome to the Golden Isle, in remembrance of my greatest success and my greatest failure. May the gods accept my offering. May I see you again. Icarus, these are the great Daedalus's wings. He must have built everything here too. All these temples. I can't imagine losing a son like that. What it does to you. Uh, wing piece recovered and Aeolus's jar back from Tartarus. Now, to find that stranger at the top of the observatory. Do it. <clears throat> what? I didn't kill Icarus. Daedalus's faulty wings did that! And where is Daedalus now? I see. Silence. I'm sure Phoenix will find out. Eventually. I thought you said you were preparing... I just saw the fog leave yeah, the rest of the game world. for you to return. You got the wings? Yes. Not really good as new, but what is? Something new? You have the jar, right? Get ready to open it! What is that?! You deceitful thief! You thought you could escape me?! You stole something from that thing?! I told you, it's a problem! Tree delivery boy! You do not deserve the crown you were given. We'll take you down, Typhon! Just like before! We? <laughs> there is no we! Not anymore! Phoenix! No! Open your wings! I can't! I have you now. You cannot hide forever. I got banished to the shadow realm. Okay, we need to get to safety. Stat. What was that? Monster! Typhon. Not THE Typhon! Oh, you have no idea. Gotta get to the Hall of the Gods, then we can talk. You ready to fly? These were Daedalus's wings. THE Daedalus, the great inventor. So? So, they didn't work right and killed his son. You'll be fine. Just don't fly too close to Helios. And, also don't try to go to the bathroom during turbulence. You should make it to the mainland without crashing. Probably. You literally robbed me, and now you're saving me. Why? I didn't follow most of what the Oracle ran through. But if the prophecy is on the money, hero on high, you're the only one who can stop Typhon from remaking the world. We don't even know if it's about me. For someone trying to help everyone right and left, maybe you should accept help once in a while. What are you talking about? Fate's alive! How is the Winged Herald supposed to provide aid when you won't let me? With the Winged Herald's aid? Wait, Winged Herald? No! Way you are Hermes. I like telling you, there goes Hermes, not Apollo, and taking long runs on the beach. Now, can we go, please? The other gods need our help. Other 
gods? You mean all the stories are real? Something's wrong with your face. It's doing that slack jod thing again. Fly to the Golden Isle. Meet me at the Hall of the Gods. I'll be waiting. And with that, Hermes disappeared. Phoenix gazed across the narrow band of sea at the peaks and valleys of the Golden Isle ahead. The long path to his true destiny lay stretched out before him. Oh shit, Wait, we playing video games. That was just a prologue. How does it take someone that long to begin a story? Odysseus made it home faster. He's about to jump. Be quiet and listen. Damn, that looks pretty nice. Funny. Maybe I can like make it. Here we go. What can I do here? like the stuff on it's <laughs> pretty great <laughs> pretty badass Like, like my anger face. Oh, that depth of field is crazy strong, though. There you go. So awesome. Own this stuff? Oh, because the review copy got it. Was the gold edition? Interesting.
Hmm, a good ass helmet. Oh, I look so do oh, yo, I'm feeling it. Pay to win right now, baby. Don't fuck with me. You can actually. So there's multiple axes you can get? Huh. Honestly, didn't think there'd be different weapons to grab. I thought you just had the one. Um, yeah. Thing to know, though. Very, very pretty game. Doesn't seem like there's any crafting in it though, which is very odd. Unless it's not open yet. Very good looking game, man. Suddenly, the majestic form of a wild creature caught Phoenix's eye. If Phoenix wanted to tame the beautiful beast, the mortal would have to befriend it first. Why are you whispering? Because I don't want to scare it away. What are you on? Because can I have some? 
Uh, you gotta tame mounts just like uh I didn't think that'd be a thing this game Ride my sweet deer. Break this tree down. Oh. Can't climb it either. Fly like a noom to the East Tar Mountains. I get like some finishing moves I can do here. to be a service demigod soldiers I die. 
Remember that. All of the gods. Definitely need some of those because I'm hurting me. It looks crazy with this armor. I think I gotta change it to go back. It's a little too wild, even for me. The sight of the Great Hall took Phoenix's breath away. This is incredible. It's all right. Could use some updating. The column motif is a bit laid out. So, we're safe here. Remember that thing I stole from Typhon? It was an itty-bitty piece of his eye to hide this place from his terrifying gaze. You're welcome. You said this is the Hall of the Gods. Well, where are the others? Let me start from the beginning. With his hand on Phoenix's shoulder, Hermes recounted the tale of Typhon, destroyer of gods. Typhon, born of Gaia, was a terrible, cruel beast who vowed to free the Titans and obliterate the gods. He challenged Zeus for the rule of the cosmos. Fortunately, Typhon was defeated. Damn straight he was! And imprisoned under a mountain, where he could do no more harm. I got to get back into that kind of shape again. For thousands of years, Typhon festered, until Helios was eclipsed, and burning stars fell from the heavens. The stars burnt through Typhon's chain, and in an explosion of fire and smoke, Typhon burst from the mountain. The gods had wronged and tortured him. Never again! He vowed. This world will be cleansed. The gods will pay! And so, Typhon sought his revenge. Destroy the veil that separates this hallowed land from the underworld. Let Tartarus walk among the gods. Trouble, devour, and turn this life false gods to dust. Come, Olympians, brandish your weapons and face me. You have underestimated my power and work in your hubris. Go to my unseatable perfection! Some gods fled in fear. Others stayed to fight. Many were captured. Typhon split them apart, cleaving their essences from them and transforming them irrevocably. In a final desperate attempt to save their lands, the gods called on the heroes of old. The last warriors who had more than a few drops of God's blood remaining in their veins. 
weak and selfish. Your heroes will exist as shadows of their former selves, serving me forever! The gods had failed, and so had the heroes. But just when all hope seemed lost... The Hive Knight, Destiny, the same. Follow like I see it. So yeah, a lot of fighting and losing. And now you are our only remaining hope to restore these lands to their former glory and save the world from chaos. All we have, Phoenix, is you. No pressure. I kind of lost track of who's who. Is that one with the spiky hair you or Typhon? Forget it. The vanquished gods need to be reunited with their severed essences to regain their power. And then, together, you must defeat Typhon. <sighs> huh. This is honestly a lot. I wish my brother was here. Look, kid, I'm not perfect. I'm the guy who escorted Pandora to Earth for Zeus's sake. But maybe, just maybe, you're the right hero at the right time. Also, you're literally all we've got, seeing as how everyone else has been defeated. Good luck. I'll be right here, doing nothing. <clears throat> I mean, beginning preparations. Thanks. I think. Oh, there's that face again. Fine. Your best starting point is to reach the top of the other statues on the Golden Isle, so you can track the missing gods. Find them, and they should be able to help you locate their stolen essences. Although, they haven't been themselves, so I'm really not sure. Um, what's that mean? Guess you'll find out. Phoenix I can't tell if he's gonna betray us, Jenner. What would my brother do? Legiron would probably take. Gathered ingredient. Oh, there nice is cold. crafting. Got Phoenix it. let the empty compliment die in the ensuing silence, and instead tried to focus on potential potion recipes. My God. Okay. Let's see what else we got here. This just got a little, not a little much, but man. Those are a few ideas for ways to stick it to Typhon. You mortals seem to need an incentive. So, I'll pay you Electrum for accomplishing each. And since I'm the god of merchandise, you can spend it right here on, you guessed it, merchandise. Ooh, creative. Or you could always just pay me your own Electrum. I thought the incentive was for me. I'm the god of financial gain. Those prizes. Wow. I'm also the god of thieves. We all have our vices. What's that underneath? It's a chore chart. Someone has to get Ares to clean up after himself. Ever try to get blood out of a sea of blood? Now that is a feat. The live pass. I'm here selling if you're buying. Animals. I mean, yeah, collect them all, man. What 
What'll it be, Phoenix? Oh, so basically... This allows you to buy cosmetic items. I think looks like. I like the look of that. What else do we have in the tower? I like how this is like a nice hub. Is this where the gods get their dental exams? No, it's where we rip off our skin to change our appearance. Huh. Still better than visiting the dentist. Okay, so you basically change. Okay. What's this? Not sure. Hades had it delivered. Deposit an offering for the ferryman, and unexpected help could very well arrive. Be careful, though. Argo broke the last gift from the underworld, and look what happened to him. Who's Argo? Exactly. Got it. This is how I get new abilities. Giant hammer the Knox. Ah, that's what I've been trying to do. We got stars and stripes here. Come on, I gotta go with the spear, baby. Come on now. All oh, these look expensive, I'm guessing. Six. Oh, this is also how you hmm. Damn, there's so many gameplay mechanics here Three hit Okay, I can increase that Dodge while in mid a hall, dude. Some of the stuff looks sick. Print. What the five dodges in a row, dude? So if you are two, I can get two of these abilities. Automatically collecting everything. Seems really useful. And so does the faster climbing. There's a lot here. Okay, I, I felt like uh, I was a little bit limited in my abilities, but now they got everything I could want and then some, so. Not bad. Last but not least. Ooh, is this Hephaestus' forge? You're cute. Try not to impale yourself on anything. 
But Phoenix wasn't listening. He was drawn to the forge by a hidden force. The adamantine he'd gathered, calling out to be reshaped. Got it. This just upgrades everything. Across the board. Well, let's make my weapon better. Burning a hole in your pocket? What is this? Looks like a workout. Bench of Zeus? <laughs> Bro. This is where you train? Oh, gods, no. What a waste of me time. Just cheat using Zeus's lightning to enhance your muscles and stamina. That's what I do. You're an inspiration. I get that a lot. Ah. Or What else do we have up here? We have so many things up here. There's that wonderful smell again. Ambrosia is life. You want increased protection? Distill it here and drink up. Then enjoy the ride. One time, Athena downed that whole Kelex and destroyed the entire Greek fleet right after she had sided with them in battle. It was epic. Sorry. Guess you just had to be there. Many of my relatives were. They died. And I told Athena not to do that. But did she listen? No. <sighs> Okay, one more ambrosia. Let me know if you're in the market for anything. Okay, I think I've seen everything I could possibly see up here. Yes, okay, I have. <laughs> 